What did we find around licenses? We identified just shy of a hundred million dollars in potential savings over the last two years. Now, granted, for many of our customers, that's based on standard MSRP pricing, but a lot of these enterprise layer customers have unique contracts that have individual pricing involved. We can't really dig too deep into that, but the $100 million number is a factual and accurate number for our customer base. Average company has around 655K in potential savings from both, or from things like eliminating the waste of licenses, reassigning inactive licenses, avoiding additional licensing costs in the form of duplicated licenses. And you wanna to jump to the next one here for me? And some more of these opportunities. So on average, the companies we studied purchasing somewhere in the neighborhood of 60,000 licenses and have 40K users, that's interesting to have that purchase versus user disparity. There are potential reasons for that. Now there are concepts like, you know, pre-purchasing pools in preparation for growth, things of this nature. So, so there's a little bit of margin for error there. But still, we thought these numbers were interesting against the subset that we tacked against. Average company had somewhere in the neighborhood of 13,000 licenses unassigned, and a half percent, and sitting on the shelf. And then another 6K inactive licenses, around 10%, for a total savings off of 32% on average. Again, 13,000 licenses just sitting unassigned, perhaps that's justified, but our point here is, Let's not guess, let's not speculate if that's justified, let's know. Let's have complete understanding, complete visibility, complete control and oversight of those licenses. If it is justified, let's be able to report on it. Let's be able to divvy those licenses up between various pools within the enterprise. Let's be able to run a report and provide a dashboard to our business leadership to justify those expenses. Bullet point, 17% had more than 10,000 unassigned licenses sitting on the shelf, while 10% had more than 10,000 inactive licenses. Again, just kind of exacerbating that previous point, unassigned licenses and inactive licenses represent potential revenue waste, dollar sign waste. Again, whether that comes in the form of saving those dollars in the fiscal year or repurposing those licenses to resources that require them, Again, concepts like attestation of license use utilization, concepts like reporting on duplicated licenses, concepts like being able to automate the reporting on of these licenses and automate the reclamation of licenses and the repurposing of licenses. These are all concepts that Corview make very, very easy and that should be taken advantage of.